jeez, I just put the same diaper on her. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Today's video is going to be kind of like a day in the life, but not really like a vlog. Just kind of just going through my whole experience with cloth diapering. So this is something that I wanted to do with our first daughter, Maya, who's four now. But I thought about that for like a split second and that was it. But with Mariah, she is exactly three months. As soon as she tinkles, she wants me to change her diaper. So that was just not gonna fly with us. I like the whole idea of cloth diapering just because it's reusable, so you don't have to like worry about constantly buying something. All the benefits and all that stuff, like I knew about with her first daughter, but luckily she has issues with being wet and just like a small amount of being wet. So I got the experience to actually do cloth diapering now. Today's the first day, so I'm just gonna go through my whole first day of cloth diapering because when I was doing all the research, how to go about it day by day. Every single video I found were people who have been doing it for years or had been doing it for months and they were like, you know, a pro at doing it. I wanted to see if it's that, you know, that simple from day one. Yeah. It's fine up here, but right here still feels kind of loose. I guess this will work. We'll see. All right, so first change of the day. She actually feels like it's sticking out a little more. Like it feels like it's uh, thicker. Look how cute this is as much as your elf bear it does. I'm still not sure about the buttons and where I'm supposed to button them at, but this doesn't feel like it's too tight because I can still fit two fingers around the whole side. And she didn't have any marks on her when I took off the last diaper, so I guess this is gonna be her size for the newborns. And I wasn't sure if I was supposed to use all these little dots either, but I guess to make it more secure, I did. So yeah, so diaper number two. She's discovering her hands now. You got it. Yeah. <laughs> but she's trying to fit like her entire fist in her mouth. But it's just funny that she actually like can see like something that this close up, cause she's like focusing so much and it's so adorable. Hi. <laughs> So I have 24, so I got four packs of six, and they're all Alva Baby. Basically, one pack of six came with 12 inserts. This is one of the bags I got. I already put the other one in the diaper bag, but it's like two wet dry bags that are like basically on the go. And then I put the, all the inserts, just one insert in all of them this morning, because these are like the pocket inserts. So I got all of them from Amazon. So I'll link in the description box of like the four different packs that I found, because I basically went by the prints that I could find. I did have two other like Wee Greco or Wee Greco, however it's pronounced. I did have those in the Amazon cart. I did have those in the Amazon cart, but they were a little bit different when it came to like the washing and just like how you actually like use them or insert them. So I wasn't really sure, so I didn't want to confuse myself because I am brand new to this. So I just stuck with all the same brands. That way it just made it much simpler for my life. It's been pretty like carefree so far. I've only changed her twice. I wasn't sure if I needed to change her again, but I brought her up here to check her at least because I'm so used to having to constantly change her every hour and I haven't had to do that yet. I think she likes it a lot better because she's not nearly as fussy as she usually is every hour. And you can see she's like having fun, so. <laughs> so I think she likes them too. And then meanwhile. Hello. Hi. I don't have the cloth wipes and Amazon like never suggested them to me, but I kept hearing them in other people's videos of like, you know, the professionals basically who've been doing this. We have like four packs of pamper sensitive wipes, so I'm gonna keep using those until we run out. But basically I wanted to just vlog this so you guys can see. Yeah, what a day in the life is with first time beginner cloth diaper er. So, yeah. Wait, let's see which one you want to do if I'm gonna change you. Do you like this one? You do? Okay. I don't know. I don't know. That was your first big laugh. It was. It doesn't feel as thick as earlier. So you must have had a big morning beep beep. So I like that these are pretty simple with just, you know, popping them open. So it doesn't take a whole lot of effort because they just pop in and pop right off. So I saw some online for different brands that it was a little bit harder to figure out. And then just pop the insert in there. Very good too. <laughs> I don't need help. So I'm trying to bring it as close as possible because I'm not really sure what her size is for this. So I'm bringing it into like the middle line and then snapping all of these, because again, I'm not really sure. It didn't specifically say on the directions, unless like I'm illiterate or something. And then same for the other side. 
I think I'm just gonna bring it to this one. And I'll keep checking just because I wanna make sure that you know it's not too tight on her. Can I have this back? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. And then with the dirty diaper, oh, bless you. I'm assuming it's better for me to take the insert out and then put it in the wet dry bag, or I guess you could just throw it in there all together. I don't know. This doesn't feel as wet. But when I take this out, which I love this aspect because that was her issue with being in regular diapers. So this definitely, it feels like it's kind of like heavy now. I'm not sure if I should just put the whole thing in there like this or if I should take it out. And I'm not really sure what this side is for with the extra pocket here, but I've been putting everything inside. So that is cloth diaper number three. Unamused. Okay, so I wanted to show my diaper bag. This is actually just a regular bag. I use it as my diaper bag. And the one thing I noticed with the diapers, it takes up way more space. So there's only two in here right now and it takes out that whole section. Oh, and this is the wet dry bag to go bag. So they take up way more space than I thought they would. So far it's worth it. How's your cloth diaper? Is it good? Yeah. You got a cloth diaper too? Yeah, no. No. Why don't you put it on your hair? It was on your forehead. It's okay. You can put it up here. No, it doesn't say. It doesn't say? Yeah. Okay. It's just like a mouse. You look so pretty. You see my mind? So baby girl is sleeping right now, but when she wakes up, I'm gonna change her because it's been a few hours now, and she has still hasn't fussed. Good day so far. So this is gonna be her fourth change. Oh, I know. I know. It's okay. As soon as we walked in the store, this is how she was. So I had to carry her. So I think she's just having a having a mood. Wait. Why isn't this matching up? Okay. All right, other side. Am I bringing this too far over? Maybe I... Ooh. Why am I so confused now? Yeah, I definitely think I had it too tight earlier. So I'm so used to like using the diaper to actually wipe her and I keep remembering I can't do that. So what's interesting with this one, this one actually didn't feel as wet. Like when I was squeezing the outside, kind of like how you can tell when a regular diaper is wet. But this one, it's like, this is drenched. So definitely, I mean, we left her in a little longer today to see if she would react, but I don't think she can really tell. But this is definitely like soaked. I'm kind of hoping that she has a poopy diaper just so I can experience it, but yeah, we'll see. So that's what they were talking about. Huh? Storms of ruin. Say storms of ruin. It's coming, my mind. The clouds. Look at that water. Okay, so we finally have a poopy diaper because it was a little bit bulgy. All right, so you can see right here this little button. I put it right here and it seemed too tight and that's why I put it right there and you can see how much of a gap that leaves. So I need to fix this. Definitely trial and error. It's about eight o'clock right now, so I might have to change this tonight, but if I do, I'm going to put two inserts so that way it'll last the entire night. I'm just gonna put this like European style button just because I feel like it's, with the cloth diaper because it's so bulky, if I put her in a full onesie, it's just gonna be too bulky and I feel like it'd be more work for me taking the onesie off to take this entire thing off. I don't know, so that's just my whole thought process. We'll see how tonight goes though. You can see that it's a little more drenched outside of the poo poo, but she didn't poop a whole lot. Did you too? Here. Yeah. You want to clean this? Yeah. Tell them what to do. You have to clean it. I guess I rinse it with cold water or hot water? Cold water. Cold water? Yeah. That thing didn't say. Uh. Hot water. Alright, so I see it coming off, but it's still like there. I'm getting ready to wash them. I don't have to do a full rinse. I guess just rinsing this just makes the stain less, I guess. But it basically just looks like a lighter version of what it looked like earlier. So I don't know, it just feels weird putting this in the, in the hamper. I'm probably gonna have to change it again around like 11. Cause that'll be like three hours from now. So maybe 11, maybe midnight. So I should probably prepare the diaper with the two inserts tonight. Or I probably should do that now. I don't know. <laughs> So take off my makeup, home newborn. Very messy. I'll try to get two, I probably need three. You okay? Pretty girl. He's a pretty baby. He's a pretty baby. He's a pretty baby. Hi. <laughs> baby girl is also teething. She's only three months old, so that's fun. Good morning. 
this is the diaper diaper two for the overnight because the other one she actually peed out of but she was in that diaper diaper for about six hours from 8 to 2 a.m. is when I changed her into this one so she was definitely very 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 full weren't you <laughs> weren't you yeah all right let's go school oh that was so cute okay so I look pretty ratchet right now but <laughs> I was not planning to be out and about this morning we dropped off Maya and then I went to Walmart to buy some time and then yes we did and then we went to his appointment this morning. So we're now sitting in CVS because he has to pick up something. I'm trying to hold out because I literally just fed her and she was playing around, but I literally just fed her and I really ah. need to change her diaper. Yeah. So I'm going to do that now in our very spacious car. Figure this is probably a good opportunity for me to actually film this. So I personally know what it's like to change her in the car since it's not a regular diaper. And I can use my wet dry bag to see what that's like. Here we go. So let's turn around. Let's go. Jeez, I really need to keep this car clean now. Oh, oh my gosh. Jeez, did I gain weight? Like, what the heck? Wee! I'm gonna sit right here. I got the lights. And I got my bed. Not bad, not bad. This is going pretty quickly. Did I just put the same diaper on you? Jeez, I just put the same diaper on her. Oh, jeez. Are we done? All done. We all done? See? You can't eat it. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. All done. Yeah. We head home. Yeah, I gotta change your diet diet. I do, but you gotta go here. Okay, so I'm about to change baby girl again. Yes, we are. We're about to change you again. And I noticed right here, it looks like it's a little more cinched at the top. Yes, it does. It kind of looks like it's, it's going too far in. So, gotta fix that. So, this is all the way in, but I didn't go to one of them. So, maybe this should go here. I don't want it to be too close. This feels so loose right here. Like, do you see this? Feels so loose right here. And yeah, that's not right. It's such a trial and error. All right, so bring this in. Luckily, these are like stretchy. Maybe that's just how they lay on the baby. So I'm debating if I want to straighten my hair for today, but I had to put on some makeup so I could look presentable for this camera. Yeah. So I think I have about eight. Yeah. About eight or nine diapers so far. Yeah. I was only playing to do this. <laughs> I was only planning to do this for just the day, but I feel like I needed to keep going because different things were happening. Hey guys, so I know you guys have seen me looking like five, six thousand different ways in this video, but it's eleven o'clock at night and I was about to actually get ready for bed, but I just realized something that I didn't do last night that I forgot to mention to you earlier. Put her diaper on at like eight oh eight PM last night. Thought I was gonna wake up and change her or she was gonna wake me and change her around like eleven or twelve, which is like kind of like normal, like usually for a feeding. And she didn't wake up again until two and neither did I. Luckily she was wearing a swaddle that was a tiny, tiny bit wet. But that was it. So the cloth diaper held up really well for just one insert. I just realized now that I put her in one insert again, probably be up for another hour. So then I'll probably change her and I'll put in two of the liners and she should be good throughout the whole night. These diapers hold very, very, very well. So, cause that held for six hours. And then the fact that she didn't notice and she usually is screaming after she tinkles within like the first hour, that's really good. So one include that really quickly. But okay. This is the diaper that I changed Mariah in the car in. So I'm gonna do laundry tomorrow morning. I wanted to only film this for like my first day, but I felt like I needed to film it for I guess two days so I could get the overnight experience. So hopefully this is helpful for people who are trying to consider cloth diapering and having that, you know, the beginning stage experience. But if you guys have any questions or anything, leave it down in the comment section down below. Like this video if you haven't already, subscribe, and I will see you guys in the next video. So bye, thanks for watching.